<clears throat> Hello everybody, how are you? Right, let's get to... Uh... Sounds... Sounds good, doesn't it? <laughs> right, okay, let's get this done. Um, I've decided I am going to go what the hey and do U876B and C today. Uh, so this is Terrain Sim World CSX Heavy Hawk. Uh, U876A and B with the SD40 2. Right. Train Boy! Hey there, how are you? Oh, by the way, Train Boy, <clears throat> been playing some Sim Airport today. Having hired the CFO and the COO and re done a bit of research in Sim Airport, I was able to adjust the pricing. And I'm now making lots of money. Well, barely a lot, heck of a lot more than I was before. So, <clears throat> oh, I said A and B. I mean B and C, not A and B. Who put that up there? Right. T Vale eighty. Thank you for the subscription. Really appreciate your support. Darth Mong, you weren't expecting a stream a stream today. No. Uh, that, was, that, that stuff is basically behind us for the time being, which means we're back to five days a week streaming. Woot! Hype! And it's so on. Right, okay. So, without further ado and faff, um, I have made some changes to my system. So, I have... Let me go under settings here. I wanted to walk, talk you through these. I am running with DSR switched on, so I've got an NVIDIA, high-end NVIDIA card, it's a 980 Ti, and that's got a thing called DSR. You'll find it in your settings. Let me just bring the dialog box up. So here, if you right-click and go NVIDIA Control Panel, go to Manage 3D Settings, and then, on, let me move it over here, Manage 3D Settings, scroll down a bit, DSR Factors, so I'm running a DSR Factor of 2. Train boy! Oh my word, five months. Matt, you're awesome. Keep up the amazing work. Empty cup hype. And let me get back to IKEA. <laughs> He's still building this IKEA furniture. It's been a week. Well done. Thank you very much, um, train boy. So I'm running at 2.2x. Uh, uh, I did run it at 4x earlier on. And it, it does hurt the frame rate. It brought me down to about 30 frames a second. But oh my word, it looks good. So what happens is that uh, what DSR does is like super sampled alias, anti aliasing, but it goes on the hardware. It's completely on the hardware, unlike SSAA which is completely on the CPU. So what happens is DSR creates a virtually a big screen. At 4x what it's actually doing is turning your monitor into a 4k screen. Yeah, At 2x it's a bit smaller than that, but at 4x it's basically turning it into a 4k screen. Um, and what happens then is that the game renders to a full 4k screen. It gets this bigger resolution and then the video card squeezes it down to the 1910 by 1080 that's on the screen. And the end result is a seriously better picture um, at almost no cost. So it's, uh, except when you're running 4K uh, four times and then apparently there's a cost. But at 2X, it's basically no cost. And then I'm running a smoothness of about 34%. If you're not running, if you're running at 4X, then drop the smoothness to zero, you don't need it. But anything less than 4X, you just put a bit of smoothness on there just to sort of clean it all up a bit because the, the technical reasons it's the way DSR works that is you get odd pixels here and there so um, so yeah I'm using DSR so let's go back the other thing I've done is I've changed a couple of things to prefer performance um, so let's get back to the game right so in here you'll see now that it says 2715 by 1527 because it's this is the DSR is saying I've got a bigger monitor. As far as the game is concerned, I have a bigger monitor than I really do. I've switched off anti-aliasing, because I don't need it anymore. And I have turned the screen percentage back down to 100 instead of being 150, which really brings the frame rate back up a bit. So those are the changes that I've made. Um, the other thing I did is my usual post-process quality down to medium, because I don't like the eye adaption thing. Right, so, without further ado, Let's go SD40. Uh, let's go Summer Cloudy. Actually, no. Let's go Winter Snow. 
continue, eh? And we're doing U876 Part B. What is, when is spin tyres? I don't know. We'll have to decide on that. There's nothing planned for spin tyres at the moment, but then Friday's multiplayer session. Right, so this is coal loading, and then we're going to do C, which is sure mind to Yoda siding. Neither of them should take that long, really. All it is, we're going to go from there to there, and that's it. Stop. Right. Yeah, it's really down to... I pick some games, and then everyone votes what they want to play. Is basically how a Friday works. Right. Are you running? Oh, it probably is. That's fine. Yeah, because I'm trying to think about when I had it in 4K. Right. So we need to go forwards and then start loading coal. There's no slow speed control on this thing, Simon. Is the passenger trains on this um, blessed? No, not yet. It's freight only. That very rude of you. What do you mean, Simon? Now you've got an inch of snow. I know. It's amazing how much the weather changes down here, isn't it? <laughs> do the trees still have leaves? No. I mean, if there's evergreens, they still have leaves, obviously, but the uh, regular trees don't. Oh, that you can't use slow speed control. Well, I did this, actually. <laughs> this is service mode, so that's me. But this, is, this isn't done with AC 4400s, this part of the line, so... Load coal. Well, actually, all it was wrong, uh, Ed, was the date was wrong. The, the, the leaves, they, I think they were one day out or something like that. So the leaves all did just dis disappear, but they picked the wrong date for winter. <laughs> And everyone's wanting York to Leeds via Harrogate on train sim. Well, I don't know about that. I think everybody everybody wants a different route. The coaling is automatic, cameras gaming. I mean, normally there's a person controlling the coal, I think.
Uh, Francois, yes, the schedule spreadsheet is up today. If you can update show for me, I totally forgot about that. Thank you. Coal loading sim. Congratulations, I've successfully addicted everyone to Eurofishing. Good, good, good. Will snow now start forming on top of the coal mounds? No, it won't, unfortunately, yet. That did come up, but we weren't able to get that in. I heard that Train Mechanic Simulator is out now, um, Train Boy, but I've not actually picked it up yet. Will there ever be BNSF engines in train sim world? Um, I don't see why not at some point train love. I mean, it's only CSX heavy world because that's what the first route is. Who's to say what um, future routes might be? <laughs> nice train boy. <laughs> What's this about a sale? March Madness is on, folks. For TS1 stuff. Train love, thank you for the subs the follow. <laughs> Much appreciated. Any sign of the end of this train yet? Did they not give? Of course they did, but we don't get the box copies in the office for every all the staff until um, like the second round of printing, um, because the first round of printing is going to the shops to, uh, you know, to do do what they do in shops to sell them. So yeah, once the first round has um, been sold, then we usually get some of the second round. Your cordless drill just died. R.I.P. your arms. No. Have you not got two batteries, train boy? If not, seriously, you need to get another battery. Wait, you do. Oh, there you go, train boy. Thanks for the reminder.
I think I can see a loco. I think we're nearly at the end. There need to be northern rail routes. Well, until Arriva took over it, northern themselves weren't interested. They said no to licensing. So uh, that's why there's none currently. Whether Arriva agreed to a license or not, I guess is yet to be seen. As in Arriva Northern. Just because they share the name doesn't mean they have the same lawyers. Oh dear. Yeah, we've got a river trains Wales. That's like first Capital Connect, uh, first um, Trans Pennine said no, even though first Great Western and first Capital Connect said yes. They, just because they've got the name first doesn't mean they're uh, um, that they're a, a shoe in. Hey, bored, Mr. Crispy? Are we keeping you awake? went in that one. Oh no, that wasn't a bad load. Oh, we've got another downgrade now. Hey Rob, he says, good evening Matt and chat, how is everyone today? I'm doing good, thank you, how are you? Uh, blessed, I think a lot of people like American roots. Certainly all the Americans tend to like them. We're not doing this for a long time. We're going to get on with some uh, other stuff as well. Yay! All up to here now and stop. And that's it for part B. Right, let's roll up to this waypoint here.
Yay, that's part B done. That's not a lot to part B. I kept that one separate because I thought if not everyone might want to do the coal loading. But every, parts A, C and D are quite good. We're going to do C, uh, part C now because that's not very long either. Oh look, one exact mile. Right, this service now doesn't start for another 35 minutes. So I'm just going to come back out to the main menu. Thank <clears throat> you.